This video is just a quick update on a design change for the 3D printed shoe last alpha joint, which is also known as a V-hinge. These joints are available with both physical and digital shoe last models here on 3dshoemaker.com and can even be designed using the 3D Shoemaker plugin for Rhino. I'll put a link in the description of this video for the original alpha joint post. The original 3D printed alpha joint design used discs as an interface between the front and back parts of the shoe last. This worked okay, but there was some laxity in the joint. In the updated joint design, the discs have shafts that get embedded into the back part of the shoe last and the pin or screw secures them in place. The assembly is nearly identical except that the discs get attached before the pins or screws go in. And a tip I would also like to add is to gradually hammer in the dowel pins or, dowel, uh, or drill in the screws, alternating between front and back rather than doing one and then the other. This allows for the use of a shorter spring, meaning more spring stretch and thus a tighter uh, joint. I'll also reiterate that a quarter inch dowel pin, which should ideally be steel, can result in a much tighter joint than a one eighth inch screw. Hardware sets that include dowel pins can now be purchased on 3dshoemaker.com. I'll link to these in the description as well as to the updated disc and spring model files. That's all for this 3D Shoemaker update. If you found it helpful, please like and subscribe to the channel and hit the bell button to receive notifications for new videos. And if you have any comments or questions, uh, feel free to leave them below. Thanks for watching.